Hey everyone, welcome to the channel. Today we're just going to go ahead and talk about ladies' mantle, its spiritual and medicinal uses. I've decided to use it from the Herbal Tarot and the accompanying book Spirit of the Herbs by Michael Tierra and Candace Canton. And we'll just learn a little bit about what's going on here, okay? Uh, they have ladies' mantle paired up with the Queen of Cups in this deck, so that's what you're seeing, all right? All right, for those that want to grow this herb, this plant, the Latin name is Alcamilla vulgaris, okay? Spiritual properties. This herb symbolizes the power of control, especially over the emotions relating to others. It can therefore help overcome an excessive dependency on another and thus help evolve a greater sense of our true worth and needs. Medicinal properties. Ladies' mantle is primarily used to regulate menstrual bleeding. It can be used both internally and externally, such as a douche, for treating leucorrhea, which is vaginal discharge, and it could also be used for treating diarrhea. Okay. Dose or preparation. Note, this herb should be avoided during pregnancy. Okay. The herbal essence may be taken in one to four drop doses as needed to foster self-acceptance and courage in intimate communication with another. Carry a small pouch of dried herb as a talisman to foster the power of self-acceptance in one-to-one -one communications with others. Medicinally, the herb can be given in a standard infusion using up to one ounce of the leaves steeped in a pint of boiling water for 10 to 20 minutes. Two or three cups may be taken per day. Take 10 to 30 drops of the tincture three times each day. The herbal allies for this plant is chase berries, raspberry leaf, and block, black haw. Okay, there you go, guys. Hopefully that helps. Have a good one. Bye.